My name is Alex Ruane. I'm a climate impact scientist here at the NASA Goddard Institute for Space Studies, also with uh, Columbia University Center for Climate Systems Research. Um, and I'm here to talk about AGMIP. So AGMIP is the Agricultural Model Intercomparison and Improvement Project. And we are uh, combining the climate, crop, and economic modeling communities to take on the challenge of food security in the coming century. And in the past, what we've noticed is that the agricultural community has been doing lots of impact assessments, but they've been done in different places with different methodologies and with different models that haven't truly been intercompared so that it's very difficult to understand how one result relates to another result. And this is especially complicated when we're dealing with the global agricultural economy uh, where commodities are grown in one place and traded and consumed in another. AGMIP connects the, the leading crop models, climate models, and economic models from around the world. Uh, we have scientists working on the global scale, looking at running gridded models over the whole world. We also have collaborators all around the world uh, working in their own backyards at the local agricultural level, um, connecting the, the field scale crop models to the regional economics uh, driven by the climate change signal. Uh, the goal of AGMIP really is to improve the, the set of agricultural models that answer the food security challenges of the next century. Um, so we are doing big intercomparisons of models uh, all around the world and the agricultural systems. Uh, we can then use the intercomparisons, the, the results of our analyses, to improve those models so that we are, are more up to the challenge of answering the big policy questions for the decades uh, coming. AGMIP is, is led here uh, out of Columbia University and the NASA Goddard Institute for Space Studies. We have uh, big collaborators uh, at the University of Florida and the U.S. Department of Agriculture, and we've also received funding from the U.K. Department for International Development, which is supporting our activities in Sub-Saharan Africa and South Asia. Um, our partners uh, really come from uh, the, the places where the agricultural is actually being done. Uh, so we have local uh, meteorologists, uh, crop scientists, and uh, economists who really understand the, the local ecosystem of uh, agricultural and economics and how everything fits together in the local politics of, of each place and also how, how local agricultural fits into the, the global picture. So one of the factors that AGMIP is taking on is trying to understand how a lot of these models which were developed for today's climate can be applied to the climate changes that we're expecting down the road. So especially important are the changes in the carbon dioxide concentration, which can have a positive effect on plants, as well as the rising temperatures and changing rainfall distributions, which could lead to patterns and, and outcomes that we haven't seen in the recent past. AGMIP really is designed to get at the probabilistic projections of, of future climate change. So what we want to do is we want to give people in agricultural regions uh, a list of projected futures that really will help them do the risk management for their area to understand whether they may need to invest in new irrigation uh, routines or maybe they need to uh, further subsidize certain types of fertilizer. Uh, really what we're doing is we're showing them the, the types of challenges that are coming down the road and helping them understand how they can adapt now and how they may uh, be forced to adapt in the future.